together again to entertain and play games. Welcome back, we're the 2-Bit Players. Hey everybody, welcome back. I'm Noah. I'm Jeffrey. Uh, we don't know where we left off. We don't know what's happening! Comment so, below with the facts! So I Give us the facts! I apologize immediately if, if we've already captured... Uh, I don't know what's going on! Who is this? We're the 2-Bit players. Who, is, who are you playing as? I'm Luigi. Why is he here? He's here for reasons. Reasons unknown. Yeah. <gasps> He's here to clean. Didn't you already clean this room? Well, everything gets dirty because it's haunted again, Jeffrey. Wait, 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 If you clean a room and you step out of the room and you come back in, it's dirty again? Yep. As long as there are ghosts. Oh. So you have to exercise the ghosts first. So I'm trying to find a So why boo. are you trying to clean this place up first? Because there's money- Kill the ghosts first, then clean it hold up. Hold on, Jeffrey. No! You hold on, Noah. I'm tired of listening <gasps> to your bullshit! <gasps> Shut up! Ah! <laughs> so I was trying to create drama. Of course. People love that drama on that So YouTube. I have to focus- Oh, I got a shit. I gotta do that. You got a shit? I got a shit. I got a shit. Got a shit. You gotta. Oh my god, dude. That's fucked up. You're just there we sucking go. those bats off. So I gotta find where. Oh, oh, look at this. Oh my god. You didn't even know about that, did you? Well, in your, I did. In your game, huh? No, 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 no. No, I did. Let's no, be no, real no. Here, you Jeffrey. didn't know. But now you know. Um, Welcome back, everybody. I know we're already welcomed, but now tempers have calmed down, and I'm Noah again. <laughs> Jeffrey. And like we said, we're the tube of players. Shit, I think I lost that boo, and it's all your fault. Hey guys, welcome back. Um, I want to apologize for Noah blaming me for stuff, but I'm mm -hmm. Jeffrey. Yeah, shit. I'm Jeffrey. And I'm Noah. And we're the tube of players, and yep, welcome we are. back. Um... It was Thanksgiving recently. It was. I want to ask about your, it was like a month ago or some shit. Uh, yeah. I want to ask about your Thanksgiving, Noah. How was it? What did you do? I went to a wedding in St. Louis. Wow. What dickhead would schedule a wedding on Thanksgiving? A friend of ours. A friend of Molly's and mine. Wow. Wow. Yeah. That dickhead was me. Thank you for coming to my wedding, pal. You're welcome. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, me and my wives are very happy. Yeah. It was an unconventional wedding. But they're all hot. I got it. I got oh it. Oh my it. god. I got it. I gotta fight the boo now. How was it? It was really good. Um The whole thing? Yes. The wedding, the whole pre wedding, the post whole wedding. The whole shebang. Hanging with the with the fam? Yeah. Uh all that shit? Yeah, no, it was all very nice. How's uh, Molly's family was, doing? They're fine. That's great. Why would they not be fine? What did I you was do just to them? asking how they were doing. Are you not American? That's what Americans do. They ask how you're doing. How the Molly's how are family's you? doing? How's it going? Is they always that? Apparently, that's not a, 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 a that's it's, a, it's kind of a bizarre thing. If you ask somebody in like Canada, uh -huh. maybe not Canada, but if you ask somebody in England, mm -hmm. how are you? They'll look at you very weirdly. Oh, where did you tell me about this? Maybe, but I, I I've heard this that it that is a very American thing to do. Just to ask people how they are. Because if you ask how are you, it's like it's like asking is something wrong. Yeah. Yeah. How are you? Oh, is that what that means? It's like how are they like I'm fine. How are Why? You? Yeah, I'm okay. Why? What's what's the matter? Huh. Oh, I'm just asking how you doing. How you doing? How you doing? Yeah, exactly. What should we say to these foreigners? I uh, what? I don't what should know. we say to the foreigners if we want to ask them how they're doing? We should do, we could do it the Australian way. How you going? How you going? How you going? How you going, mate? Crocky? Crockety? Yep. Um. I just want to know how people are. Yeah, great. Well, how was your Thanksgiving? It was good. I worked from 2 p.m. to 10.30 p.m. Fantastic. Uh, the Universal was kind enough to hook it up with free Thanksgiving food. Ooh. Yeah, I got some Turk. Mm. Got some mash. Mm. Got some grave on that. Mm. Got some green bean. <laughs> I got some stuff. <laughs> nice. I got some... Some, some Cass? No, no, no! I got the mac and cheese, mm. and oh, and I did, I get, I did get a a a a, a bread roll, for like okay, a, a brol, a brol, a Josh and, uh, Brolin, and it came with some butt. Okay, <laughs> I just rubbed some butt in there. Rub some butt on your brolin. Butt in the roll, butt in the brol. Um, and it was it was a good amount of food. It was free. I just walked in and then that piles of it, and I like, take it. 
<laughs> we don't want it. It's, <laughs> um, it's a week old. Look how look all this money we can just throw away. They just had it all laying out there in the dumpster, and I was like, wow, this is really free. You guys are great. <laughs> Um, no, it was, it was good. Um, and it was super quiet. It was very chill. Nice. And then what? You went and I heard there's a story involved oh, with your new, and then afterwards, with your new it was, phone. It was Thursday. Oh my God. Yes. So embarrassing. You brought this up. I didn't <laughs> want to talk about this. Um, but I, my old phone. Yeah. Was a Samsung Galaxy S6 Edge. Four years old. Fantastic. And uh, it wasn't it wasn't working so hot on me anymore. So I was like, I need to get a new phone. So I wanted to get the Pixel 4. So I was like, hey, Pixel 4 is $400 off at Best Buy on Black Friday. But I'm like, yo, bro, it's Thursday. They're going to be open from 5 p.m. to 1 a.m. Thursday night. I get <laughs> off work at 10. Perfect. I'm going to go to Best Buy after work. I go there. It's crazy. It's pouring rain. I somehow find a parking spot very quickly. I go into Best Buy. There's people everywhere, but there's nobody at the phone area, which what? is weird. There's a couple people there. But... Oh, I was like, what? The phone oh, the, area? I mean, they're working. Oh, yeah, yeah. oh, yeah, but the the phone, the, you know. The yeah, where AT they sell the phones. And Verizon, all that shit. Yeah. And so they helped me out pretty much right away, hmm. which was very convenient. Um, and they're like, what do you want? I was like, I want the Pixel 4. They're like, what service? AT&T. And they're trying to tell me they don't make the phone. They don't make that phone for AT&T. <laughs> and I'm trying to tell them to go fuck themselves. And they're like, oh, wait, I'm trying yeah. to tell them that. I'm trying to tell them to do that. I'm trying to find the right words. And they're like, oh, wait, no, you're right. They do. But we're sold out. Like, that's bullshit. This is a Black <laughs> Friday deal. It's not even Friday yet. You're sold out? And I was like... Because they haven't gotten their Black Friday stock in yet. It's bullshit. And then I'm like, okay, well, are they selling them anywhere else? And they're like, no. I'm like, you didn't even check. But whatever. And then they're like, you want to order one? I'm like, how long is that going to take? They say five to seven business days. I'm like, cool. Um, fuck me, I guess. I guess I'll do it then. I was hoping to get one today. And they're like, cool. Um, who? What is... Uh, so the, I'm on a family plan. So my grandpa's in charge of the family plan. Mm -hmm. and they're like, what? what is the last four digits of his social security number? Holy shit. Are you serious? <laughs> Why are you asking me that? I have my AT&T PIN number account. The PIN number? I have... The email for the account. I got the password for the account. I got all kinds of shit. I do not have my grandfather's social security number on me. <laughs> and it's 11 o'clock at night. It's 12. It's midnight where he's at. And I'm like, no, he's asleep. Anyways, called him three times. Didn't pick up. And uh, I was like, I guess I'm not getting this phone today. Sad. And Sad then day. I was like, all right, fuck it. So I go in the next day. I got work at 2 p.m. I go in at 1. It takes mm -hmm. me 10 minutes to get there, 15 minutes to park. I go in, and I'm like, yo, I want to get my phone. And there's a <laughs> ton of people around the phone booth at this time. Mm -hmm. And somebody comes up to me. He's like, oh, have you, have you been logged in, they say? I'm like, well, what do you mean? Like your place in line. Have you logged in your place in line? I'm assuming some sort of technical type in my shit. And she's, I was like, no. And so she pulls out some paper and a pencil. And she, <laughs> she's like, what's your name? What phone do you want? What's your provider? And I was like, yeah, okay. Um, how many people are in front of me? And she's like flipping through pages, like 15 15 people are in front of you. I'm like, okay, Is cool. that a lot? To me, that doesn't sound like a lot. That is a lot. Okay. Um, And I'm like, how long is that going to take? They're like, I don't know. It's like, cool, because I got to leave for work in 20 minutes. <laughs> so I'm going to go, and then I get all annoyed, and I'm like, well, fuck, dude. I can't even pick up the phone. I'll just order it online. Hmm. So I get to work. I bust up my lappy tappy. I go to bestbuy.com and yeah. I type in all the stuff and it's like, cool, uh, pull in, log in your, your account info for your provider. And then that woman shows up with a piece of paper again. And she goes in and she she's logs like, you in. You're 4,000th in line. Um, and it's like asking for the zip code to the account. Okay. The zip code, which would be in Arizona. And so I type in the zip code and they're like, this is wrong. So I go to Google and I'm like all zip codes for this town. And there's five of them. So I put in the other four. All of them are wrong. And I'm like, you know what? I have all the info for our cell phone account. Uh huh. So I log into the legit account, pull up a bill 
and I look through all the stuff. Trying to find the zip code. And uh, he has it uh, logged in Colorado. Why? They have a house in Colorado. Oh. And I guess they set it up in Colorado. For tax purposes. For tax purposes, probably. Sure. Who knows? So I'm like, oh, okay, cool. So that's the zip code. Got it. Go back <laughs> to Best Buy. Type in the zip code. It says, no, fuck you, fuck face. You've tried too many times. You're locked out. <laughs> Hot tub's too hot! Hot tub's too hot! The hot tub's too hot! Um, and so, no. Okay. I'm not done. Okay. So then I Google, what the fuck? How long is this? And they're like, oh, yeah, yeah, you got to wait a day or so. So I get really frustrated. My coworker rolls in. He's like, bro, check it out. Got a new watch. Black Friday deal. I was like, that's a nice fucking watch. <laughs> Where'd you get that watch? He's like, got that fossil. I'm like, is there a fossil around here? He's like, yeah, literally 15 seconds away from where we are. They have one at City Walk. It was like going there, I buy two watches. Uh, so I could feel better about myself. Now I got these cool watches, which you like, right? You like this watch? It's pretty dope. It's a nice fucking For those watch. viewers that can't see, it's like an analog digital hybrid. Yeah. So it looks like an analog watch, but Jeffrey presses a magic button and his phone starts playing Spotify. My phone starts playing fucking music, which I'm not going to do because it's all copyright. Yep. But yeah, it's not, there's no digital interface on it. It's it, So it's like it's literally hands. It's Because I'm, I'm not really that into the digital the digital thing, it just kind of weirds me out. Um, it doesn't weird me out. It's just not my mm -hmm. style. But this is, it's a hybrid smartwatch. Um, Fantastic. So I bought i bought one of those and then I bought another one that wasn't hybrid, but it was an all black watch. It was $150 on sale for 56 Pause for a second, no, Jeffrey. No, I'm not done. I want everyone to know that I've solved this puzzle in my own game, but I can't hear anything with Jeffrey's story and he won't stop talking. So. I haven't even gotten the phone yet. So fuck this puzzle. I'll come back later. So... Next day, I'm like, okay, I'm going to try to get my fucking phone again. I go on to bestbuy.com. I type in the info, the correct info this time. It says AT&T does not have a count with this. This AT&T account does not exist. Why is it doing this to you? And I'm like, what? This is impossible. I'm looking at the bill. All this shit is correct. And I'm like freaking out. I'm like, I know this is right. So then I just type it in again very slowly. And then it works. Obviously, I typed in something, a, a wrong number. Oh, I thought you, it was actually, obviously, I was typing it in too fast for the computer to no, handle. No, I just did it very slowly to make sure it was all correct. I think I messed up the social bit. Hmm. Which your grandpa's social is again, what? It is 6969, uh, 246769. Lucky grandpa. Yeah, he's a pretty cool dude. Uh, <laughs> 24769 for, for gramps. <laughs> Um, for gramps. Anyways, I go on there. And this is where my story ends. I go on there and it shows up all the stores and the store that I was at, they were sold out. But the one in West LA, they had a phone. Oh. And I was like, you lying fox. And then another one in somewhere in LA had three of them. You fucks. So I bought the one in West LA. I drove down there and I... And immediately just dropped it on my floor right now. Drop my phone. Oh yeah, it's cracked. It's okay. What? No, it's... Oh. <laughs> no, bro, Gorilla Glass, homie! <sighs> okay. Speaking of, I gotta definitely buy a case for this thing. Yeah, I'm so going, you just dropped it on my floor. I'm going, yeah, on your hard, hard carpet. Uh, or rug, rather. Uh, but anyways, I got my new phone. I'm pretty excited. The Pixel 4 is pretty dope. Mm. Um, it, it's got this cool feature on it that it's just, you know, whatever. If I... Oh, I wake up my phone. It'll tell me what song's playing. What, anywhere in the world? Yeah, any, well, that's playing within the room. Oh. So I was watching Star Wars, and I looked at my phone, just looking at it, and it was like, oh, Stars in the Skies by John Williams. Huh. I'm like, holy shit. Speaking of John Williams, look at that. Juan Williams. It's Juan Williams. Juan Williams. <laughs> da, 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 da. Hey, speaking of Star Wars... I'm trying to make it really bad. So oh, it's okay. You don't get flagged. Speak <laughs> yes. <laughs> Speaking of Star Wars, Molly and I watched, I <gasps> got Molly to watch Star Wars for the first right. time. Right. What'd you start with? Episode four. <sighs> That's a bad idea. Why? You should have started with one. Well, that, uh, so that was my thought. You should have started with one. I just finished three last night. Okay. We should do this together. <laughs> okay. Well, okay. Okay. Sorry. I'll Continue your, your, your terrible story. So... She was like, cool, I respect it. Not my jam. Not my She's jam. She's not like a big like super action like sci-fi movie person. Okay. Um 
But she's like, okay, cool. So she, we're, 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 she's down to watch like the rest of it. Uh huh. Oh, yeah. Then she would definitely hate episode one, two, and three. I, I mean, that's <laughs> so. You know. Yeah, you might not even want to fuck with those. So we start with the originals just to like respect the classics, you know. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Um, I think we're actually going to do Rogue One next because it's the direct prequel to episode four. So it'll tie up that like whole arc of getting the plans for the Death Star and then mm -hmm. destroying the Death Star. Spoilers. Yeah. Oh shit. So, um, there's some weird fucking shit in that movie, that first movie. Did you watch it on Disney Plus? Watched it on Disney Plus. Okay, yeah, they did some stuff. They added some stuff? They changed a few things. What did they change? I know they did the whole Han shoots first thing. They fucked with that some more. Well, yeah, it's fine, whatever. Uh, and I they kept in the weird the CG editions. Yeah, I have the originals, uh, theatrical versions in okay. HD. If you Do want. all the original versions have, you know, okay, so Luke gets accosted by the Sand People, right? In yeah. the very beginning. Yeah. And then uh, yeah. Ben Kenobi shows yeah. up. Yeah, I know him. And does he make some weird fucking sound? <laughs> Actually, yes. the original, he makes an even weirder sound. Really? Yeah, it sounds like, like a weird siren thing. But in, I think in the remaster, he just kind of screams or something, right? Yeah, you hear this, like, bellowing noise happen. Then it cuts to him, and he's, like, waving his arms like a scarecrow on crack. Yeah. <laughs> being like, <laughs> Yeah, I don't know what version it is there, but, yeah, it, the original, it was almost like a wind kind of. Okay. Like a alien wind sound, and, and then they change it to him just like screaming or some shit. It's so fucking weird. It's a weird moment, no matter what version you watch. Yeah. It's weird. And then I had to laugh, which I'm sure every you know person that's like really into Star Wars has already noticed. Um, obviously, there's the joke that stormtroopers can never hit anything in, ever, ever, right? Ever. And yet there's the scene when they return to the the Jawa Sandcrawler, and he's like, "Oh," and Luke's like, "I think that was the." The sand people that did this. Oh my god. And then Kenobi's like, no. Like, these blast marks are too accurate for sand people. <laughs> Only the elite uh, stormtroopers of the Empire have accuracy this, this precise. Oh, I don't remember him saying yeah. that. He's like, yeah, making it so, so nice that these uh, <laughs> stormtroopers are like this elite police force with not. unparalleled, uh, yeah, weapons and accuracy. Oof. Yikes. Yeah, that didn't age well. Yep. But uh, but she but she thought it was all right. Yeah, it was fun. That was, was honestly my exact opinion of it when I watched it for the first time in yeah. high school. And the ending is so rushed. Yeah, it's just like all of a sudden, bing bang boom, yeah. we're there. We were pausing the movie. I'm like, there's 40 minutes left, and they're just rescuing Princess Leia now. I'm like, yeah. they got to get to the rebel base. They got to no. do all this stuff. It's, it's like they get her, and then all of a sudden they're like, we need to blow this shit up. And then it's like they're in the ships. It's like they got to do it now. Yeah. It's fucking crazy, and then it's like, oh, it's over. I feel like the movie takes place in like two days, you know? Seems like it, really. Um, it's a, such a tight, quick little movie. Yeah. Um, but yeah, the episode four is good. I think it's a solid movie. Episode five, I think, is where it peaked. Hmm. Episode five is, is actually like a really great sci-fi hmm. like drama movie. Yeah. Um, I assume she would like that one more. Yeah, so, yeah, we'll tackle that third, because we got we got Rogue One next. She's dumb as fuck. You know what? Oh, she already saw Solo. She saw Solo. Solo. <laughs> um, when are we going to end this episode? After I beat this boss. This is a little bonus extra episode. Boner little... action boner! That's the two-bit promise. The two-bit promise, we promise you a boner! When we start a boss, we won't finish it. We won't end People the episode. We won't finish the boss. <laughs> Ever. Ever. No, we're going to keep fighting until the cows come to roost. So this pianist has uh, possessed this pianist. This pian pianist. Pianos. Piano. And so he's shooting his keys at me, and then he goes up here, and then he launches bombs, some bowems. Did you I guys watch The Irishman? No, not yet. You got it? Yeah. It's really good. Oh, speaking of things that, that you need to watch, did you watch Don't tell me what I need to El watch. Camino? No. You need to watch that. No. We watched that on the plane to St. Louis. No. And, like, literally, uh, they're like, oh, okay, turn off all big electronic devices. And we had, like, 15 minutes left. We're like, fuck! <laughs> like, we got so into it. It's supposed to be really, really good. Yeah, it was really good. And so, yeah, we got into our Airbnb, like, at 1245 past, you know, past midnight. And we're like, we got to watch it. Got to finish it off. I know we got work in the morning. But we, <laughs> we can't go to bed until we finished El Camino. Work in the morning? What do you mean? We worked remotely. 
Oh, oh, that's smart. Yeah. Um, yeah, so you didn't feel any re need to rewatch Breaking Bad. You just dived into it and you were good to go. Yeah. I, mean, I very, very strongly remember like that whole last season, especially mm -hmm. those last eight episodes very, very well. Yeah. I don't think I'd have any trouble jumping into El Camino because it picks up like. It picks up literally immediately, like immediately at Je after. Jesse's drive. Oh, fuck. So, I'm going to die. Don't ruin it. Noah. Okay, fine. Jesse's doing what? Don't <laughs> tell him what he does. Stand up. Doing stand up? Yeah. Comedy at the no, club. No, I died. Are you kidding me, dude? Thanks for the view. Now comment, like, and subscribe because we're all just two-bit players.